space seems <coughs> pretty chill. Just <laughs> what I needed. What the? Earthbane, do not be afraid. We are from the planet known to you as Proxima Centauri B. You are being summoned to our craft. <laughs> Human, I am the entity known as Zolstar. You have been selected to join us on a galactic voyage. And I am the entity known as Zanspec. We wish to reveal to you the secrets of the universe. Uh, will I need to bring my jacket? I feel like I should definitely bring my jacket. You will have no need for external coverings. We will provide all you require for comfort. I feel like I'm still gonna bring my jacket. Maybe my toothbrush. I got a copy of volume four. You can't really travel through space without tunes. You misunderstand. We are going to reveal the inner workings of the cosmos. You will require no. Where is he going? Hey, I'll, uh, I'll be right back. Who picked this guy? Hey, Ruth, we're heading to happy hour. Care to join us? Uh, just one second. Get a load of this guy. Whatever. Hey. Should I get some more stuff? Maybe some more records? I can pick us up some burgers. We have a DVD player, a projector, anything? What do you think? I got a pretty good sleeping bag I can bring. How do I even get home? Where's the button? Where's the button? Oh, is this it? Don't touch that! Hello, Wastoids. Looks like I'm gonna be running off with some outer space dudes.
name is Autumn Kidd. I am 22 years old and I live in Phoenix, Arizona. I started uh, taking photos in 2019. Uh, when I went to Europe, I just like brought my camera and just take pictures of like anything that I saw and like people and like things and like the people that I stayed with. And then whenever I got back, like my friend hit me up to take photos of him and like from there it's just kind of started searching for like models and like, you know, just taking pictures of whatever I saw and like whatever kind of came to mind. So like the inspiration for like my last shoot is just kind of like like a woman kind of going going crazy a little bit and then also just kind of like the ideas that old like country music kind of convey of just like uh, I need to leave this town and like there's just nothing for me besides the open road and being alone is better than anything you know but with then then like within all that old country music there's like a lot of longing and so just those emotions kind of inspired that. I think what I'm trying to go into is more of a, a theme and like a message with my work. Um, I think a lot of it is just kind of playing off of what I'm feeling and in a lot of ways I don't know how to put things into words. A lot of times like if I'm feeling something it's just like just in visuals. Themes to what I'm trying to go for now are more so like um, characters to just kind of embody the different emotions that I don't quite know how to word or don't know how to like display myself. Um, and that's where I'm, I think I'm heading in that direction. Yeah, so to like get into like the headspace of like the character thing that I'm trying to to convey, um, I'm noticing with myself like I really have to, like um, really have to like put on the kind of music that it that gave me those visuals, or I have to like look at the kinds of photos that I got inspired from, or um, the kind of feelings that I want to convey. I have to like bring those forward. I can't just like go from listening to like very happy music to like shooting some like weird freaky kind of like dark stuff like I have to to be in that and so um like another thing to it with editing and um that's not just in the photo and so that that gives me that takes some time and like I have to like draw a little bit and like do other other creative things and come back to that before I can like um, really have like an idea in my head for what I want to see in there. So my future plans with photography, um, I'm going to be moving out to Philly in the summertime and um, just kind of like expanding expanding myself and like the, the kinds of things that I'm inspired by out there. Um, and I think like being surrounded by green and like seasons will definitely influence me and influence my work um, and just kind of like give me another perspective on it that I think will be really cool to transfer over into visuals and see how that goes. Shout out to everyone who's, you know, hit me up to shoot, anyone who's liked my work, anyone who's supported it, anyone who's like done any of that kind of stuff. <laughs> just cause like I just never, I don't know, taking photos is always like, I guess being a photographer, I'll use those words, um, is not something that I ever like thought I would actually do. I thought it would always just kind of be an idea in my head. And so just to be received with so much love means a lot. So that's all <laughs> I'll add. <laughs>
Earthbeam, you must prepare yourself for a long voyage into the heart of the galaxy itself. Okay, but I just need to grab the rest of my stuff first. As previously stated, your items are immaterial. We are possessed of technology you cannot imagine. Whatever you believe you may need, I can assure you it is not required for this journey. Yeah, but I've, I've, I forgot my stash. Is it, a uh, pretty good stuff? The best Earth has to offer, my great friend. Okay, but I'm going with you, and we're making this real quick. Are you almost done or what? Uh, yeah, he's just looking for his, uh, car keys. Be right there. Man, what's that guy's problem anyway? Yeah, sometimes I feel like he just doesn't understand me. He's a dick. Yeah. But this is good stuff. Yeah. That's it. I'm going down there. <laughs> Really? Hey man. Hit this. I guess, since we're already late. What did you say this program is called again? Oh, it's called Wastoids. But I think it's over. What do you guys want to do now? Just chill, I guess.
W-A-S, towards. <laughs>